Hey guys, in this video I am going to show how to create filters in react.js. For this I have a demo application which lists the countries from a JSON data and uh, in browser you can see the results. It just displays the list of countries along with their flags. So here is the list of countries uh, that I have stored it in the JSON file. So now I want to add a search box over the top of this page to give user an option to search the country he is looking for. For this, let me introduce an input field at the top of the countries. Yeah, it's here. And now uh, let's create a state variable name uh, search to store the search text user is typing or uh, looking for. After creating it, uh, now we need to create a function uh, to update the state whenever user types in the search box. So you should not uh, directly set state variable. Always use react's uh, set state function to update the state. Now whenever a user types something it will trigger an on change function to update the state. There are two ways to filter. One is by adding the function in render country method to check if the string in the local state variable is available on the name of the country just before when rendering your card. For this I am going to import the search from the local state variable. I know I'm going to add a condition over here to check if the string is present in the countries. So if this matches uh, we will uh, return uh, the string or we should uh, return null. So for this uh, I'm going to use uh, javascript index of uh, string function to check if the string is uh, present or not. So index of function will uh, return uh, minus 1 if the not is available as a substring inside the string. So if it is equal to minus 1 then uh, the string is not available so we are returning null. So if you see in the UI uh, we will be able to search the country like Algeria but the problem here is it is case sensitive if you search for Algeria in lower case you will not be able to find it to make it case insensitive you have to add lower case uh, to both the country name and the search string so it should be two lower case JavaScript functions I'm just comparing it after converting both strings to lowercase. That's it. Now, if you see the results of this change, you can see that uh, now the search is actually a case insensitive search. So, see here. Now, I'm going to search for Algeria in lowercase, and it is searching for Algeria. And now, this is also works. The other method of uh, doing this is to filter before mapping the country results. For this, uh, let's comment the filter that we uh, added uh, previously. And here we will use a filter function to filter the countries using just search string. Now it's more or less uh, same uh, to what we did before. But now uh, we are just iterating uh, the uh, map mapping the function that uh, was already filtered. Now okay. country list dot filter. And then we need to add a condition for uh, filters. 
let's say if we return now to lower case now we should uh, map this filtered countries uh, array into this and we just need to render all the countries that was already filtered so if you see the output it will be the same as we did for previous search so let's say I type Algeria it will search so it is up to you to choose uh, which method to use since both uh, yields the same results